half hours apart uh, meeting up. Strike one pitch is swung on, one hop smash, second base, Kluska backhands, flips to Tucker at short, one to first, oh, they got him a double play, an acrobatic double play, four to six to three, Kluska to Tucker, what a turn up the middle, and picked out of the dirt by nothing Marshall. Stretch A, stretch is, runner going, swing and a miss, there's a strike, throw down, and they got him. It was to the right field side of second, but Mikey Kluska with a quick swipe tag is really amazing. Here's a one two pitch as Tomahawk in the air right center field. This will get down and hit the gap. Hussey hits second on his way to third. Braden Berry give him an 11 game hit streak. He is white hot right now for the Mountaineers. Braden Berry with a double. You're going to have to live with the the other team trying to control the running game. One ball pitch is swung on line shot right center field. Davis off to the races hits second. He's on his way to third. Steve Saban's going to wave him around third. Ball juggled in right center field. West Virginia's on the board with a weather hope. Two out RBI double. Four to one now in the third. Well, just a good swing there by weather hold another barrel. Now every Mountaineer in the lineup has hit a ball hard today. And that line drive right direct. We've not been lacking WVU. Sports news runner going one two pitch is high throw down a second and out West Virginia is able to get another out on the base paths. Dane Leonard throws out his second base runner of the day Christian. Oh yeah which is uh, actually the photo that I took as Holbrook swings and pokes a ball through the right side of the infield base hit Hussey digging for a third throw coming in cut off and then scampering back to second Hussey gets back as Here's the pitch to Mikey Kluska. Swung on line drive underneath the glove of Edwards at third. This will score one. Leonard around third. He will score into second. Mikey Kluska. Mikey, I like it. Two runs for West Virginia to make this a one-run game, and the tying run is out there in scoring position. Mike Runner at second, two outs. Tucker swings, line shot, base hit right field. This game is tied. Kluska rounds third. He'll score. The ball gets by in right center. And here's Tucker going for three. He's there standing. Tie game four to four. West Virginia, three runs with two outs. And W. And still looking for more. Top of the order. Austin Davis swing and a line drive. Base hit left field. Tucker in from third. And the Mountaineers have the lead. Austin Davis with the RBI single to left. That's four straight two out hits. That's four straight. Man, you have to be excited if you're a Mountaineer baseball fan with these two. Three and one. Pitches swung on. Little looper. Base hit. Here comes Davis around third. He'll score. Weatherholt hustling for a second. Throw in. And save. Double. West Virginia six. Marshall four. Oh, is this fun? <laughs> it really is, and it's deserving with the way the Mountaineers swung the bat. The divide between old and new school. Oh, one pitch is swung on, line shot, left field, down for a base hit. This will score a couple. Left fielder Williams, his throw cut off, and another two out hit. This a two run single to left by McGuire Holbrook, West Virginia. Payoff pitch, Smith, Plateward, and strike three call, got him. Quickly two down in the sixth. Coming out here to see WVU and Marshall. Here's a one two. Swing and a miss, strike three. They get Carinchi, who's now 0 for 3 on the day. And one gully 345. It's part of alumni day as a swing and a miss here. We'll get on the other side of Sankovich. Nasty pitch down and in from Carlson Reed. The sun fighting through the clouds, illuminating the field as a 2-0 squirts by Leach. Here comes another run for West Virginia. It's Hussey scoring from third and WVU going ahead 9-4. While Abernathy 3-0, runner at third. Nobody out, a run in, five run lead West Virginia. And here's another wild pitch to the backstop and not even covering the plate. Sharp allows Abernathy to score standing. A carom back. Uh -huh. Can't wait to do that. Uh, certainly isn't going to be me. 2-1 is away from catcher Leach to the backstop. A run will score. That's three run scoring wild pitches and corked by Marshall. He runs here in the seventh. 
and threatening for more. One two pitch, a high chopper, third base. Coming home with it. No, nope. Edwards throws high to first. Everybody's safe. Run scores. West Virginia 12, Marshall 4. Oh, Edwards, I thought, or not, I didn't. Nick Wayrich, tall right hander, fires, and this pitch is lined to right field. Base hit. Run scores. Kluska in. And Austin Davis has his second RBI of the afternoon, his third hit of the day. And WVU leaves and 73 strikes. Next offering is high, and that's another walk. One, two, three, four walks in the inning to go along with the two hit batters. That'll walk in a run. West Virginia is now in the lead by 10. And the offering is outside, ball four. That'll walk a run in. West Virginia leads by 11. It is 15 to four, Mountaineers. Hypolity in from third. Kahn goes up to third base. Smith to second. Weatherholt for Rokiski. Two hit batters, two walks, and make it three walks. Bases loaded, free pass. We'll bring in another. It is 16 to four. Vic Scott will drive in his name's in. <laughs> 3-1 pitch. Swung on, one hopper over to second. Alex Kahn has it, as Uncle Jesse would say, have mercy. Oh, boy. 17-8, West Virginia wins it by nine. A four-run ninth inning for Marshall, but West Virginia able to stave off the yeah. thundering hurt. Yeah, I mean, it got to the point where you were wondering there. Not much left. Uh, but Oak did a nice job. He came in and threw 12 pitches, and only four of those out of the strike zone. He did exactly what he had to do. The ball got put in play, and the Mountaineers get win number 100 at Wagner Field and Mon County Ballpark. That is so true. They've won 62% of their games here and they're missing.